All right. So, what's up, everybody? So I'm back for episode 24. Um, I got the first. Uh, yeah, I got the first. Yeah, I got episodes 21, 22. Well, no, 22, 23, and 24 up uploading to YouTube right now. So, um, and I'm, I'm still in the same exact spot as we were not too long ago. Um, um, so, basically everything's nice and shiny, cleaned off, which I'm pretty happy about that, so, all except for the plant. Well, except for the field cultivator, which that will eventually get cleaned up. So, um, anyway, do I have the intentions of getting this, getting this spader back? No, I don't have the intentions of getting that back because, first of all, it's it was a big pain in the butt, and. Second of all, it was not something you wanted to, um, not something I ever wanted to run again. So, but a new tractor will be joining us on the farm, which is of course a Case IH 7220. Now, the 72, now that 7220 only has 188 horsepower. Which means that it'll probably have to be a 7230. Give me a minute. Alright, so anyway, 7230 might do me some good because it's got 207 horsepower. Which means, yeah, it can... Do a lot of things, we'll, you know, basically show you how it's going to look. I'll go all the way down here. Seventy-two thirty, right here. And then we're going to go with... We go with narrows. Now, these look more American on this tractor, so that's why I decided to go with the. That's why I decided to go with narrows. Now, if I was thinking about it, I would go with like a seventy-two forty, but seventy-two twenty might be big enough. It might not. That's why I'm gonna just stick with a 70, that's why I'm going with a 7230, so that way I don't have to worry about all that other stuff, so, yeah. So this will be the new tractor that will come to the farm. So two United States tractors and only one tractor which is partly North American, but at the same time also European. 4755 so two case and one John Deere for tractors now, I never like the uh, now I don't like to overrun them farm with a with American mods but that's just how I do so the um, beans should be grown about now so Anyway, yeah. So it'll take us a few days. Um, if I can go through time now, hopefully, hopefully the beans can grow up just a little bit more. So I'll see you guys when, I, when time goes through. All right. So I'm back. It is snowing, of course.
So there we go. Now everything's starting to jump up. A few notches. So yeah, you know, but I can't wait until we start combining beans. So yeah. You know, But also, you guys, I might so um, I might I might I might not get this. Mm, What it does is it just scoops them all in a windrow and it throws them in the bucket, which is underneath. So, I might end up getting one of these, I might not. Just all depends. And that's certainly a big one. All I got is the little guy right now, so. Yeah, um. Hopefully be getting that one, but like I said, I don't rightfully know if I want to get it or not. I haven't ran the thing yet, so. But right now it doesn't matter because we're not picking rocks yet. Besides the that Dagelman rock picker is just does a Fine job. So, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping um, oh, I'm hoping a few mods that I've been waiting for come out soon. Which, unfortunately, we did get new mods today, and I mean they're not they weren't all bad, but some, none of them were North American. So I'm pretty upset about not having any North American mods coming out yet well sure there has been a few but just hasn't been enough to um, please me yet when there's enough to please me then I can just overrun the farm with North American styled equipment but when there isn't any or hardly is any North American styled equipment, then that really, and that really puts the old lid on the old sour pot. Doesn't make me happy, not one bit. But I kind of like the rock picker because it's more North American to me. Because Dagelman basically is just about a North American styled brand. So, who knows, I may or may not keep the Dagelman. I don't know. I may upgrade to get the bigger one. But then that means I have, would have to run it with the 7150, and I don't want to do that. That's why I'm scratching around for something a little bigger, so that way that tractor can keep its duels on and not have to take them off. So... Yeah, but I don't know. I'd hate to have them. I'd hate to have that mm, uh, 8960 do them rock picking. You know that how that would go. Wouldn't go smooth at all. So I may figure something out. In the 7200 series. Or an international 70... 130. Nah.
So, anyway, we might just end up getting a 72.30. Because, in that way, 271, well, 207 horsepower is not bad, so... Yeah, we might, we might not, but we'll just have to wait and see. So, anyway, yeah. Um, so, beans still aren't ready. Gosh dang it. Really want to have those beans ready so that we can combine. But, can't combine really when it's... And the beans are still like that, so. The combine is safe in the barn, so it's not going to get cold. So, I have the, all the doors shut on the barn. But the poor tractors, though, they get the, they sit outside in the freezing cold. Except for this one. Since it's got, it's got the engine further up and behind the wall. Well, this one's got a hood on it, so it won't get cold. Not that easy, that is. So, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. We'll see. Anyway, yeah. Let's see how it goes. It's... Something that you'll never, ever figure out. Hopefully, we'll, hopefully I get around to getting um, getting this all um, fully grown and then combined, hopefully tomorrow, but don't know. I just have to, I'd, I'd just have to wait and see. And I'd also just have to wait and see and see if I go to my grandpa and grandma's tomorrow on Friday, which the answer is probably going to be no. I'll never know that. I mean, I haven't gotten sick yet, so I'm assuming I'm fine. If I can just head over to grandpa and grandma's, it do probably don't make a big deal to me, but probably will to my mother. So anyway, yeah. So probably won't get the combining in this video. We still have a few months get them wait but um so still snowing and beans should be up going here in a a little bit. Which, if I go into here, which I can see on how my crops are doing. So, yeah. But I should be able to get the combining, hopefully, if the beans decide to start growing or not. So. Anyway. Yeah. But I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. And hopefully tomorrow we can keep going through the days and keep going through the days and we will you know, hopefully we can get the combine tomorrow so anyway see you guys then bye